video tutorial I will explaining how to find circular references in Excel. You are getting a warning message about circular references when you are in Microsoft Excel. There are one or more circular references where a formula refers to its own cell either directly or indirectly. This might cause them to calculate incorrectly. Try removing or changing these references or moving the formulas to different cells. First thing you want to do is just click OK on this warning message. And you have got to find out where the circular reference is. The first place to look is down on the status bar. You can see that it's telling me where the first circular reference is it's in cell D19. The other place I can go to find out where a circular reference. Go to the formulas tab on the ribbon bar. Then go over to the error checking menu. Then go to circular references and we are that also tells me i've got a circular reference in cell d19 now let's go into d19 and see what the problem is so this formula is adding up these numbers but in the range it also includes this total cell that's why it's circular reference so all i need to do is change that cell d19 reference to d18 and now the formula works and i've no longer got a circular reference in that cell but it looks like I have got more circular references. You can see here that Microsoft Excel's warning me that there's some sort of circular reference between these cells. Down here on the status bar it says there's a circular reference in H10. And if I go to the error checking menu, circular references, I can see in fact there is a circular reference in H10 and H19. So let's have a look in H10. So the formula in H10 is referring to H19. Let's look in H19. Well this formula refers to H10 to get its result. So there's the circular reference. So what I'm going to do rather referring to H19. I'm going to refer to D7 with as an actual value. If I press enter thar gets rid of both the circular references. I no longer have a circular reference on my status bar. And if I got to formulas error checking circular references, you can see it's grayed out which means I have dealt with all the circular references. Okay that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is please give me a thumbs up and